Hi there! Gretchen here from Shaker Library. Have you ever wished you could learn new skills in business, creative, or technical fields, either for professional development or just for fun? Great news! All you need is a library card to access online classes for free. In this video, I'll show you how you can connect to LinkedIn Learning content with your library card and give you a quick orientation. Let's get started! From the library's home page at shakerlibrary.org, we'll choose the Resources and Research tab here at the top. Click on it, and that brings up an alphabet menu. We're going to choose L for LinkedIn Learning. From here, we have various options, and at the very top is LinkedIn Learning. Click on it, and here we are. We're on the home page. We'll go ahead and click Get Started. And now we need to enter our library card number and a PIN. If you're not sure what your PIN is, remember that it's probably the last four digits of your phone number, the one you used to set up your library card account, unless you changed it. If you have any questions, you can always call the library reference desk and we'll help you figure it out. We'll click Continue. and we're in. Next, LinkedIn will do an interest inventory. We'll click Sounds Good to begin. You'll choose what interests you. For now, I'll choose just one thing, graphic design. You'll see later how content is tailored to that interest. We'll hit Continue. And now, we're asked to set a weekly goal. I can change this later if I want to, but for now I'm going to choose 15 minutes and click Set Goal. And now click Start Learning. Looking over the home page, notice that because we chose graphic design in the introductory screens, our content has already been provided relevant to that field. I'm going to actually suggest, however, that you begin with how to use LinkedIn Learning. This is a wonderful video to help you get oriented. To save it, you'll want to click here. And now when you go back to your home page, which you get to by selecting this little house up here, you will find that it's been stored there for you. Now to get it started, you just click on it. And um, you can see a description of the class here, course details. And you can learn a little bit more about your instructor. If you were to select this link, it would tell you more about him. You can see all of the different topics that are taught. And you don't have to watch them in order. You can pop around and choose what you want to view and uh, ignore what you don't want to view. And then over here, notice that there's related courses. You can also get a transcript, which is helpful if you um, are a uh, visual learner and you like to read as well as listen. And um, I'm going to go back here, back to home, and show you again where it's saved. All right, in our last minute, I want to show you one more feature. Up here at the top, next to that search box we used earlier, is the Browse feature. Click it, and here we will find all of LinkedIn Learning's content organized for you into three basic categories. There are business topics, creative topics, and technology topics. Say we were interested in learning about cloud computing. We could see all of the content in that field listed here. Um, but perhaps you don't have a ton of time to watch today and you just want short videos, you can filter by time. We'll select 10 to 30 minutes. And now we have a list of courses that are just 30 minutes and under. Cloud concepts, determining your cloud strategy. Let's say we want to learn about that. We click save. And now when we go to our home screen, there it is saved for us along with our how to use LinkedIn learning video. 
So I hope this helps you get started with all that LinkedIn Learning has to offer. If you have any questions or are having trouble logging in, please contact us at the library. Thanks for viewing and happy learning.